If you are a kind of person who ignores bad dreams, you are one of the most careless beings on earth. Just a wonder dream has ruined many lives. A wonder dream has shattered many brighter ambitions. A wonder dream has turned a person who should have become a big successful businessman or a woman into a street hawker and or a street beggar. Just a wonder dream has turned the life of some people upside down and worse, a bright future has been ruined just with one day dream. Listen, when someone collects money from your hands in your dream, it means they want you to become poor in your physical life. Yes, and when they give you money in your dream, it means the powers want to change your life to the poorest life and worse. That is why if you are the kind of person who ignores bad dreams, you are the most careless being on earth. The Bible says in 2 Corinthians chapter 10, verse 4 to 5, For the weapons of our warfare are not carnal, but mighty through God to the pulling down of strong words, casting down imaginations and every heighten that exalted itself against the knowledge of God, and bringing into captivity <laughs> every thought to the obedience of God. When a witch or a wizard attacks you, he or she is exalting himself or herself against the knowledge of the Holy God. And the Bible says, For the weapon of our warfare are not carnal, but mighty through God, to the pulling down of strong holds. Hallelujah, for the Lord God omnipotent reigns. The Bible says, Casting down imaginations, inventions, any evil plans for glory with Christ in the highest, and every high thing that exalts itself against the knowledge of the Holy God, glory be to Christ in the highest, and bringing into captivity, I love that verse, and bringing into captivity every thought to the obedience of Christ. I pray in the name of Jesus Christ that every power that rise against you this year shall go into captivity in the name of Jesus. Amen. Because they must obey the Lord. Yes, they must obey the Most High God and get out of your life. Yes, because you serve the most superior God that all powers in heaven, the firmament of heaven, on head or under the head beneath, in the head and sea, bow to. Glory be to Christ in the highest. Listen attentively. The only God did not say they won't fight with you. He knows they will fight against you because you are not of this world, even though you live in this world. <laughs> but you know what it says. The only God says, and they shall not prevail against you. I stand upon the word of the Holy God and I pray for you in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. All they that rise against you this year shall fall flat in Jesus' name. Any powers that shall fight against you shall not prevail against you in Jesus' name. Amen. Because Jesus is the rock, yes, and the rock shall crush all your enemies in Jesus Christ's mighty name. Amen. The truth is that for your enemies not to prevail against you, you also need to rise and do the needful. You must be ready to pray and watch the Holy God fight for you. Yes. Now let's dive in deep. Anytime you have a bad dream, immediately when you wake up, don't speak to anyone. Don't even chat with anyone. If you heard that type that always have your phone close to you all the time, don't chat with anyone at that moment. Then after that, pick up your Bible and not your phone. Firstly, pray according to what you saw in your dream about how you want the Holy Ghost to restore either what the powers of darkness took from you in your dream or whatever you saw and, and want the Holy Ghost to do, you just say it. It has a big warning. Yes, but the warning is never speak gibberish or blab in the name of you are praying in tongues. Many people do that, which is not biblical and which is very wrong. It is a mockery. 
to the gift of the Holy Spirit. So never do such. Never speak such human fabricated tongues in the presence of the Holy God. Else you are on your own. But pray in your language and be focused. So after this, change your prayer to the reading of this powerful Psalms. I'm going to display that on the screen. The first Psalm you're going to read is Psalm 83. Yeah, but when you get to verse 4, say it as a first person singular. Yeah, change it to you mentioning yourself as the one there. So when you get to verse 6, at verse 6, the tabernacles of Edom and the Ishmaelites of Moab and the Hagarites, Jebal and Hamon and Amalek and the Philistines with the inhabitants of Tyre, Assyria also represent all the evil altars of your enemies that rise against you and all those that support them. So therefore read Psalm 83 three times and also read Psalm 35 three times and Psalm 91 three times and give glory to the Holy God for answering your prayer and that is it. So by doing this immediately you wake up after having a bad dream, you are sending back their evil plan or their evil works back to them through the power of the Holy God. So that is why it is very important. If you can practice this, if you can do this all the time, whenever you have bad dreams in the morning, immediately you wake up in the morning. When you do that, you surely see the glory of God. You surely see something great. Yes, you see you see something great and you also glorify God because what you will see will be, will be so great and even your enemies will be you know they will be troubled because the Lord shall attack them so your enemies shall see the mighty hands of the Holy God and you shall be free from all evil from all the evil works from all the evil dreams that you have so that is why never uh, never underestimate any bad dreams you have because Many lives have been ruined through the same bad dreams and just with one dream. So continue to trust in the Lord and have faith in Him and you shall see His glory and manifestation. So thank you so much for watching today's video and I will implore you to please share this video out. Please support this channel by sharing it out. Let this video go viral. Let it reach a lot of people. You know, some people might need this video. Some people might need this advice and so people might have been having a, a bad dreams which they don't even know what to do. So just send this video to your friends, your loved ones, share it on WhatsApp status. You know, by doing this, you're supporting this channel. So thank you so much for watching and God bless you all. See you all on my next video.